Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. When you want to issue a single paycheck to a single employee, you can enter that paycheck into the payroll entry window. You can also use this window to enter handwritten payroll checks if needed. To open this window, select Tasks from the menu bar and choose the Payroll Entry command. You select the Employee ID of the employee for whom you're creating the paycheck from the Employee ID drop-down. If you plan on printing this check, you would leave the Check Number field blank as you will be asked to assign the check number during the printing routine. If you don't plan on printing the check, then enter the number of the paycheck that was issued into the Check Number field. Next, enter the date that you want to print on the paycheck into the Date field. In the Cash Account field, the last account used for a paycheck will be displayed. You can change this account if necessary. In the Pay Period Ends Date field, you would enter the date that the pay period ended. Below, in the Salary Amounts or Hours Worked section, you will see the hourly rates or salary amounts for the selected employee. You can enter the amount to pay your salaried employees here, or enter the total number of hours worked per pay level type within the Salary or Hours column. You will also see the Employee and Employer Deductions, Additions, and Contributions appear in the area to the right. You can change the amount within these fields if needed. Then, if you need to print the paycheck, simply click the Print button in the toolbar, and then click the Save button when you're finished to save the paycheck entry. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.